Did you know that if you bought $100 worth of Bitcoin in 2010, it would be worth over $48 million today? Quite an astonishing fact, isn't it? Bitcoin, a digital currency created in 2009, has seen explosive growth and continues to offer potential for significant profit. But what is Bitcoin really? Well, it's a type of cryptocurrency, a digital or virtual currency that uses cryptography for security. It's decentralized, meaning it's not controlled by any government or financial institution. Instead, it operates on a technology called blockchain, which is a public ledger containing all transaction data from anyone who uses Bitcoin. This decentralization is one of Bitcoin's main appeals, giving users more freedom and control over their money. But it also contributes to the volatility of its value, which can lead to dramatic profits or losses. So, the question is, can you still make $100 a day with Bitcoin? Let's find out. Bitcoin mining, it's not about pickaxes and hard hats, but it is a way to make money. You might be wondering, what does mining have to do with digital currency? Well, it's quite fascinating. Bitcoin mining is an essential process that keeps the Bitcoin network secure and functional. Think of it like a giant decentralized ledger where every single transaction made with Bitcoin is recorded. This ledger is known as the blockchain, and it's the heart of Bitcoin. Now, to ensure that all transactions are valid and prevent fraud, these transactions need to be verified. That's where Bitcoin miners come in. They use powerful computers to solve complex mathematical problems that validate transactions. Once a problem is solved, the transaction is verified and added to the blockchain. But, of course, this process isn't just for the good of the community. Bitcoin miners are incentivized to do their work. For every problem they solve, they are rewarded with a certain amount of Bitcoin. This is known as the block reward. The block reward not only compensates miners for their efforts, but also introduces new Bitcoins into the market. However, it's not as simple as it sounds. Bitcoin mining is highly competitive. The more miners there are, the harder the problems become. And because the problems are so complex, mining requires significant computational power which can be expensive. Moreover, the number of Bitcoins rewarded for solving a problem isn't fixed. Roughly every four years, an event called halving cuts the block reward in half. This is designed to control the supply of Bitcoin and prevent inflation. So, while Bitcoin mining can certainly make you money, it's important to consider the costs and competition. It's not an easy get-rich-quick scheme, but a process that requires significant resources, time, and dedication. So, Bitcoin mining can be profitable, but it's not the only way to make money with Bitcoin. Trading Bitcoin is like trading any other financial asset, but with a twist. You see, while you're still buying low and selling high, the volatile nature of cryptocurrency can make this a thrilling and potentially lucrative endeavor. Let's start by understanding what Bitcoin trading is. In essence, it's the act of buying Bitcoin when the price is low and selling when it's high. Sounds simple, right? But the trick is in knowing when these highs and lows will happen, and that's where strategic planning comes in. There are various strategies that traders employ to maximize their gains. One of the most common is day trading. This involves making multiple trades within a day, capitalizing on short-term price movements. Day traders need to be on their toes, monitoring the market closely and making quick decisions. Another strategy is swing trading. Swing traders take advantage of price swings within a trend. They buy when the price dips and sell when it rises but over a longer period than day traders, usually over days or weeks. Then there's the HODL strategy, a term that originated from a typo in a Bitcoin forum, and now stands for hold on for dear life. This strategy involves buying Bitcoin and holding on to it for a long period, regardless of market fluctuations. It's a good strategy for those who believe in the long-term value of Bitcoin and aren't bothered by short-term volatility. But remember, while these strategies can be effective, they're not foolproof. Bitcoin's price is influenced by a multitude of factors including market demand, the state of the global economy, technological advancements and regulatory news, to name a few. So, it's essential to stay informed and make calculated decisions. Trading Bitcoin can be a high-risk, high-reward game. But with the right strategy, a keen eye on the market and a healthy dose of patience, it can lead to significant profits. And just a quick note, always trade responsibly, only invest what you can afford to lose, and never let the thrill of potential gains cloud your judgment. Trading Bitcoin can be risky but with the right strategy it can lead to significant profits. Did you know you can earn Bitcoin without even buying it? Yes, you heard that right. There are various ways you can accumulate Bitcoin and we're about to dive into some of them. Let's start with Bitcoin faucets. 
These are websites or applications that reward users with small amounts of Bitcoin for completing simple tasks. These tasks can range from solving CAPTCHA, clicking on ads or even playing online games. The reward might not be substantial but remember every little bit counts and over time these small amounts can add up. Another way to earn Bitcoin is by completing online tasks. Websites like Bituro and Bitcoin Jet pay users in Bitcoin for completing tasks such as surveys, testing apps or watching videos. This is a great way to earn Bitcoin if you have a bit of spare time on your hands. Now let's talk about a more traditional way of earning Bitcoin, accepting it as payment for goods or services. If you're a business owner, you can start accepting Bitcoin as a form of payment. This not only exposes your business to a wider tech-savvy customer base, but it also allows you to accumulate Bitcoin without spending a dime. In addition to these, there are other methods such as Bitcoin tipping, where users tip each other for posts or contributions that they find valuable or entertaining. There's also Bitcoin lending, where you can earn interest by lending your Bitcoin to others. So, as you can see, there are numerous ways to earn Bitcoin without necessarily having to buy it. It's all about creativity, patience, and a bit of hard work. But remember, while earning Bitcoin can be a fun and low-risk way to accumulate Bitcoin, it's essential to stay vigilant. Always ensure you're using reputable platforms and services, and never share your private keys or personal information with anyone. Earning Bitcoin can be a fun and low-risk way to accumulate Bitcoin, so why not give it a try? You might be surprised at how quickly your Bitcoin wallet can grow. Investing in Bitcoin is a long-term game, but it can be a profitable one. The world of cryptocurrency with Bitcoin at its helm is a dynamic and ever-evolving one. It's like a digital gold rush, with investors pouring in from all corners of the globe, hoping to strike it rich. Let's break it down a bit. Investing in Bitcoin is essentially buying the digital currency and holding on to it for the long term. This strategy banks on the premise that Bitcoin's value will increase over time. It's similar to buying gold or stocks where you purchase an asset and wait for its value to appreciate. But why Bitcoin? Well, since its inception in 2009, Bitcoin has shown a remarkable capacity to grow in value. From being worth just a few cents, it has reached highs of tens of thousands of dollars. This kind of growth is unprecedented and has drawn investors from various walks of life. However, it's not all sunshine and rainbows in the Bitcoin world. The value of Bitcoin is notoriously volatile. It can skyrocket one day and plummet the next. This volatility can be nerve-wracking for investors and has led to significant losses for those who bought at a high and sold at a low. So, should you invest in Bitcoin? The answer is, it depends. It depends on your risk tolerance, your financial goals, and your belief in the future of digital currencies. If you believe in the potential of Bitcoin and are willing to weather the storms of volatility, then investing in Bitcoin could be a profitable venture for you. Remember, investing in Bitcoin isn't a get-rich-quick scheme. It's a long-term commitment that requires patience, resilience, and a keen understanding of the market. It's not for the faint-hearted but for those who are patient and willing to take a risk, it can lead to significant profits. So, tread carefully, do your research and make informed decisions. Bitcoin has the potential to be a game-changer in the financial world. Be part of it, but do so wisely. Investing in Bitcoin can be risky, but for those who are patient and willing to take a risk it can lead to significant profits. So, can you make $100 a day with Bitcoin? The answer is, it depends. It depends on how well you understand the dynamics of Bitcoin. While the Bitcoin boom has certainly opened up opportunities for profit, it's not a guaranteed road to riches. Understanding Bitcoin mining is crucial. It's a process that requires significant time, energy, and technological resources. Trading Bitcoin can also be profitable, but it requires a solid grasp of market trends and a knack for timing. Earning Bitcoin through various online platforms is another viable option, though it too requires a level of commitment and patience. And lastly, investing in Bitcoin is a long-term strategy that has proven fruitful for many, but it's not without its risks. In conclusion, making $100 a day with Bitcoin is possible, but it requires knowledge, strategy, and a willingness to take risks. So, whether you choose to mine, trade, earn, or invest in Bitcoin, remember to do your research, be patient, and never invest more than you can afford to lose.